Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week, and we're just moments away from kickoff time. Stay tuned for the live action. Hello, everyone. Great to be with you from Stamford Bridge. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Chelsea facing Brighton and Hove Albion. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Well, in this 4 5 1 shape, it will be interesting to see how close the wide midfield players get to their main striker. Will they stay wide or play through the inside right and inside left positions? We'll have to wait to see how it develops. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. And the contest begins. Caicedo. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And passing it through. That's a useful cross. Well, that is offside. Well, he's just not aware of the situation. He needs to be onside there. Caicedo Sancho Well, not hard to read that pass Difficult to stop him And in with a real chance Oh, clean through But he's missed it Well, it's a massive chance But he never really looked in control, did he? Madueke, Caicedo, Jaden Sancho, and Chelsea looking dangerous, but they dealt with the threat posed. Jorginho Ruter, Joel Feldman, Ruter. And he keeps going. It did look on for them, but not to be. Madueke. Will he shoot? The fans hope so. And there it is! The opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it.
Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. Rutter. Useful looking position, you've got to say. But really sticking to the task defensively. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Madueke. Adam Webster. Now with Ruter. Well back. And return to Welbeck. Well, can they open up the defence here? And he's made headway. And the keeper to the rescue. Well, he takes some beating, that's for sure. It really is a top-class save. And the short option preferred. Dunk. Oh, it's a goal! And certainly a deflection off the defender into the back of the net. Well, here's the deflection, as you can see, but you can't blame the goalkeeper. He was just wrong-footed there. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Palmer. Madueke. Caicedo. Sancho now. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Well, 2 1 it is here. Welbeck. Had a play for a Brighton throw in. Kaoru Mitoma. Gusto. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Well, almost at half time here, and it's Chelsea on top. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts as regards what they've put into the game. Well, it's been a lively first half, hasn't it? Both sides have looked dangerous, but I think they do have a bit more guile in the top third of the pitch, and that's been key to them leading at the moment. Ruter. Welbeck. On to Ruter. 
Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Options in the centre. And the snuffing out of the cross there. Chelsea unable to hold on to the ball. Welbeck. Jorginho Ruter. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Welbeck. Can he get them level? Brilliantly blocked. Jaden Sancho. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. So the beginning of the second half here at Stamford Bridge. Joel Feldman. Webster in possession. Now with Ruter. Distributing it well. More than decent passing sequences, but they need a leveller. Oh, totally committed, but still dangerous. Moises Caicedo. Brighton regaining possession. Sancho. Kukureya, Madueke. Oh, that's an interesting pass. A routine save. Ruter. Viefer. That's a lovely ball. And credit due, a good intervention. Palmer well great read there to intercept Fernandez thirty minutes to go then. Moises Caicedo. Not a passing sequence that's easy on the eye. I just couldn't play that decisive ball. Viefer. Dunk on the ball. Welbeck. Well, he could really get at the opposition. And teammates to play it to. And making sure there was no danger in the end. Mats Viefer. Brighton a bit wasteful in possession. Sancho. Noni Madueke. Jaden Sancho. This could be troublesome. And the chance is on. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form.
Well, as the replay shows us, Sancho picks out the pass to beat that defensive line and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Underway again with the score at 3-1. Into the final 20 minutes. Able to skip past his man. Looking for the angle. Really sound defending. Will he find the net? Well, capable of so much better, to be honest. Well, I expected more as well, Derek. I thought from that sort of position, he had every chance of scoring, but it's a poor effort. Kaoru Mitoma. On to Ruter. Kaoru Mitoma. Decides to shoot. That is how to keep it out of the net. Enzo Fernandez. Caicedo. Madueke. Moises Caicedo. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Well, he passed the power test. Shame about the accuracy. Well, standing off them here, are they being too passive? Kukureya. And playing it back. Jaden Sancho. No chance, perhaps. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Dunk. Options in the middle. Well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. Well back. And there the move will end because it's offside. Close, though. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. But in the closing phase, and Stuart, Chelsea have been tremendous today. Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously been fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy unless they have the ball. And they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Viefer. Caicedo. Kukureya. So the final whistle now. It goes down as a victory for Chelsea to the delight of their fans around the world. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.